Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the channel today. Today's August 4th. In today's video, we're going to be trying out this uh, Adam's Polish's Tire Rubber Cleaner. Never used it before. Now, I got this in the petrol box. And we're going to be using it on this Ford Raptors, cleaning up the tires. Well, we'll, well, today we're going to be doing a full detail on this truck. So, check it out. So, uh, basically what it does say, it says it deep cleans tires, remove baked on tire dressing, blooming, and this coloration stuff like that removes oxidation wax and residue from rubber plastic and trim so you can use this to clean your plastic trim also and then basically it says clean one tire at a time rinse with a powerful blast from the hose spray on the tire sidewalls literally with the tire Adams tire and rubber cleaners scrub sidewalls sidewalls with Adams deep clean brush or you can use any brush we're going to use that bra tire brush we got in the petrol box and basically it says rinse really good so let's try it out on these big tires on these all-terrain be it good wrench like the wheels too they're power coated it doesn't say how long to leave it sit oh, i like how it sprays it sprays nice Soak these things up. Oh yeah, you can see it working already. Look at that. Now it doesn't say to use on wheels, so I'm not gonna try it on wheels. But I'm sure you can use it in here. Clean up your plastic a little bit. We're gonna be doing a complete detail on this, so we're gonna be having a bunch some videos on this uh, truck. And uh, you guys, if you want, look out for them when they come out. But check that out. It's working pretty good already. a little bit more yeah it's getting it I don't know when the last time he put a dressing on here looks like gonna be tires like this gonna use a quite a bit and the next tire I'm gonna wet it first with the hose and see how it works Put some water on it before I spray this. We'll do it both ways because it's right now it's like almost in the 90s and it's evaporating pretty quick. So, gotta work quick or just keep spraying a couple spots when they dry out. Check out the brush. I'm gonna rinse them off and see what they look like, and then we'll um, we'll check out the we'll do the other tire wet. All right, let me get off my tool. There you go. Looks like I missed a couple spots by the letters. Right in here. But why it's wet, let's try it. Looks like I'm gonna have to redo it anyway. I don't know what he's using to clean a tire, so so I would expect at least clean them twice but basically with any product to get them uh, pretty clean. I mean that's what Seems like every time I clean tires, I'm gonna, I usually have to scrub them twice to get everything off. Especially with the heat, kind of drying the product out. So I figured, try it with the tire wet. Let's see if you guys use this product, let us know. Do you like it? Any, uh, if you do use it, any uh, tricks that you have with it? Make it easier? Or is there another product you guys like? Let us know in the comments. It's working pretty good. Yeah, I say, especially in hot days, I would wet the tire first and then apply the product. It gives you a little bit more working time. You can tell. Leave it up. 
get in here and scrub more. It's not drying out as fast. It uh, it also seems if you guys use the water, it seems like it kind of foams up a little bit better. Yeah, you probably can probably can dilute this and put it in a spray bottle, to save some product also. Yeah, we used quite a bit, but this was a little low anyway. Check that out. Mix it real good. All right, we'll let that dry and we'll come back and take a look at it while we do the other ones. Towards this, I'll have it right there. Yeah, yeah while I'm scrubbing this too, I looked this up. because, Like I said, I got this in that uh, petrol box. For uh, 16 ounces, it's like $17, I believe. And then it's, I believe it's on sale a little bit cheaper right now. I mean, for 16 hours, I don't know. That's, I mean, it works good so far, but for the price, I mean, to me, that's a little bit expensive in my opinion. Um, I mean, there's other products out there that can do wheel van tires for that a little bit cheaper, but it is working. I mean, I just, the product's great, but I think, like, on a lot of these products, I think they need to start uh, looking at prices, different companies that are offering different stuff, offering the same results um, at a cheaper price. Uh, you know, I figure you bring it up, not the best uh, atoms, but, I mean, it works, the product works great, it's just the price uh, standpoint. You know, cause I figure I'd bring it up because I know some of you guys are going to watch it and then some of you may bring it up about the price standpoint and with other products being cheaper you know and you can do the wheels and tires with other products all right we'll look at the one tire that's dry in a second let's rinse this off But it's too I'll agree to direction. This is a a good cleaner degreaser. I mean for for this product too, you could probably use it to clean your, your engine bay up. But it does say a degreaser. I have to try it on one of my cars. So I mean I figure I bring that up too after the price point. But yeah, it should be it should be a little bit cheaper. Okay, all done cleaning out four tires. Take a look at it, it's pretty clean. I got a couple spots in here, but I didn't want to get too close to here. Um, to scratch the uh, powder coating. But um, yeah, it works really good. Um, and another thing too, I was reading on it, it's a degreaser. And you can use that to clean up your plastic trim too. So this will probably be a great product to clean all the plastic stuff in your engine bay, or even uh, clean your engine. So basically you can, uh, that's what it seems like to me. I could do a separate video on trying to clean out the, the, some of the grease on my uh, Ford Fusion um, and see how it works on cutting the grease. But yeah, so basically it's just a tire cleaner and a you know, grease cleaner did a great job cleaning it. Like the only downfall in my opinion it would be the price, you know, for 16 ounces. Um, that's about it really. That's the only downfall in my opinion is the price. I wish these, uh, they would lower it a little bit, but what are you going to do? That's my opinion on it. Works great. So you guys tell me what you think about the video, and thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Like I said, we're going to have a few videos on this Raptor. We're doing a full uh, detail on it today. And um, I'll show you in those videos the products we're using, stuff like that. So thanks for watching, guys. You guys have a great day.
Thank you.